Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I am Benedict and I'm with my teammates, Fame and Epi. Together we are Carbon Eliminators. The most tragic event I experienced last year was the death of my best friend, Steven. He died as a result of a fire that broke out while he was cooking with his kerosene stove in the house. This has been the case of so many men and women across developing countries of the globe, with Nigeria inclusive. This has led to the motivation of the carbon eliminators to invent a more user-friendly, pocket-friendly and health-friendly alternative for cooking as compared to the other methods of cooking in Nigeria. Our project is driven by green energy, which adopts a business model known as ecopreneurship, which is small-scale in nature, locally driven, and integrates environmental, social, and economic benefits. Over the years, food has been prepared using various methods such as firewood stove, which is the oldest method, kerosene stove, gas cookers, induction stove, and a lighter for others. While some of these methods are expensive to purchase and more expensive to maintain, others are less expensive to purchase but come with a whole lot of negative impact, such as diseases like tuberculosis and lung cancer, deforestation that arises from trees being falling down to make firewood, the release of carbon dioxide gas into the atmosphere that in turn results into ozone depletion, which one of its effects is global warming. Research, according to the World Health Organization, has proven that for a person to cook three square meals using the firewood system, which is breakfast, lunch, and dinner, it's equivalent to smoking 3 to 20 packets of cigarettes daily, which is obviously at an alarming rate. The problem is that about 57% of the Nigeria's population still cook using the firewood stove, with the advantage of it being the cheapest method, despite the death of about 98,000 persons yearly. 27% of the Nigeria's population cook using the kerosene stove, that also resulted to the death of about 100,000 lives annually. A small fraction of the Nigeria's population, about 5%, Cook using the gas cookers that has led to the death of about 20 persons, 20,000 persons, and is also responsible for respiratory illnesses. Our solution, the DC stove. This necessity made the carbon eliminators think of a better alternative for cooking with an idea called DC stove. DC stove is a rechargeable electronic device powered by direct current. This device is used to cook at a low cost and high efficiency and emits no form of carbon oxide. Our concept will reveal how this is possible. Avoiding fossil fuel, this is stove generate heat for cooking by an array of 200 milliwatt laser diodes and cycling at the bottom of the cooking pot. Each diode generates a heat temperature of 160 degrees Celsius. And due to variation and other factors affecting heat transfer, this temperature will be reduced to about 110 degrees Celsius, which is still, which is still above the boiling point of water. And also, this diode requires 6 volts and 600 watts. And because of this little voltage, the DC stove can be charged and powered by three different alternatives. The first alternative is with renewable energy sources, such as wind turbines and solar panel. The second alternative is with an adapter being connected to an inverter. Then the third alternative is making use of that same adapter and plug it into a wall socket when there is an electrical power supply or national grid. So with any of these alternatives, you can make use of the DC stove. Our competitive advantage is the DC stove emits no form of CO2. The DC stove is relatively e economical. The DC stove has no chance of fire outbreak or electric shock. The DC stove pro will provide ready jobs for capable hands while helping to facilitate economic growth and development. Similarly, when we compare the cost of making use of a DC stove annually to the cost of making use of other major uh, power supply for cooking, we discover that a kerosene stove user would save $242.95 per annum a, a firewood stove user would save $143.87 per annum and a gas cooker user would save $143.33 per annum. Our unit economics. With one DC stove sold at a retail price of $66.25 per annum, a net profit of $8.34 will be made while using penetrating market prices and other financing options. Our target customers. Our target customers are everybody. By that I mean the rural residents, the urban residents, the tertiary institution students, the restaurants, event planners, the caterers, and the boarding schools.
our sales channels are the wholesalers, the retailers, and our agents, while also involving local distributors. Our market plan in our phase one would launch out, in our phase two would grow, and in our phase three would expand. Our market channels are the billboards, the door-to-door -door marketing, websites, social medias, and the likes. Our financial projection at the end of the first year, we should have sold over 15,000 products while impacting massively in the life of over 75,000 persons. At the end of the fifth year, we should have broken unimaginably even. And at the end of a decade, we should have sold over 1 million products while impacting massively in the life of over 5 million. Our environmental unit economics will show that at the end of a year, we would have made sure that we uh, cop the release of 4,000 kg of CO2 into the atmosphere with just one DC stove. So the carbon